Hey there, everybody. It's Wednesday. It's 11 o'clock uh, Central, and I wanted to go live today because it is a big day around here. It is podcast launch day. I'm so excited. I have been thinking about doing a podcast for years. Trust me, my best friends can attest to this. They've been hearing about it forever, and it's finally here. I've recorded the first few episodes. Um, we are out on Stitcher and iTunes. There are links in the um, comments near this video. It is called the Transforming Anxiety Podcast. And like I said, it is currently live on iTunes and Stitcher. I will be on Spotify. I will be on iHeartRadio. And um, let me know, where else do I need to be? Feel free to comment and let me know what other platforms you listen to podcasts on and where you would like for me to be. Um, it's a process to get these things up and running. <laughs> so um, it's taking a little longer and is, uh, you know, it's all, it all is, some of it's just out of your hands. I'm just looking over here to see who's hopping on. This is so fun to be with you guys live. So I'm going to be doing these Facebook live videos every Wednesday. And what we're going to do, this will be the day that the podcast launches. Most podcasts are going to have a free downloadable goodie, worksheet, roadmap, checklist, something that's going to go along with the content of the podcast. So I thought we would talk a little bit about that in these Facebook Live videos. And then, um, oh, here comes Maya. So this will be truly like behind the scenes stuff, right? That's one of my cats. <laughs> Um, but we'll do some um, Q&A if you guys have questions about stuff, if you have questions about last week's episode, or if you just have questions about anxiety in general. The idea of the podcast, we're going to cover a whole bunch of topics with the podcast. The anchor is always going to be anxiety. That's the thing that is my thing. That's the thing that I write about. It's what I coach people on. It is what I'm doing all the time. <laughs> reading, writing, researching, um, it's all rooted in anxiety. So the podcast will always come back to anxiety, but like I said, we're gonna cover all sorts of topics. We're gonna talk about work and relationships, family, parenting, um, money, nutrition, sleep, um, movement. That's a really big one. You guys all probably know what a devout and devoted yogi I am. So we'll talk a lot about yoga, we'll talk about meditation. They all relate back to um, self-care and this idea of really cleaning up our minds, getting our mindset exactly where we want it to be so that we can create the life, the feelings, the behaviors, and the results that we really wanna see in our lives. So like I said, the anchor will be anxiety. That's where most things will start and kind of circle back around to. Um, but we're going to cover a whole range of topics. So let's talk about the first episode real quickly, since that's the one that's out today. And is, of course, that's where we're starting, episode number one. Here comes Maya again. Um, so today we are talking about three ways to transform anxiety today. Something that I really think is important with the podcast and that I really want to make sure happens with each episode of the podcast and with each download that comes along with the podcast is that you are getting actionable tools and tips and resources that you can put into action in your life. I feel like in the self-help world and just like in the whole like self-care has become very trendy and there's it's kind of a buzzword. Um, all of this self-love, self-connection, self-discovery, and it's all wonderful, wonderful stuff, right? I mean, that is absolutely the field that I'm in. I think it's a rich and valuable world. Where I think we go wrong is when things get a little bit fluffy. <laughs> if they get a little, um, if there aren't practical, pragmatic steps that you can take, then to some extent, it's not all that helpful. It may sound nice in the moment, but if you can't take something and put it into action in your life, if you can't take something and say, okay, I'm going to do steps one today, I'm going to do step two tomorrow, I can do step three the next day, and start to see real results in your life, then I think we're missing the mark. So with the podcast, each episode is to have really practical steps that you can take, that you can put into action. They may not all speak to you. Of course, we're all different. 
they may not all really resonate with you. Some of them may seem simpler. Some of them may seem a little bit more confusing. Some of them may seem weirder. Um, you know, who knows what we're going to get into. But the idea is, like I said, that that at the end of each episode and, and when you come to the website and you get the download for each episode, that you have something that you can put into action in your life. So that's the goal. So episode number one, three ways that you can transform anxiety today. There, the ebook, there's an ebook that goes along with this one. It's very pretty. Um, and it just touches on three different things that you can do today, literally, that will transform the experience that you have of this emotion of anxiety. Say hi, Maya. There's Maya. <laughs> All right. Stay right there. Um, so the ebook, like I said, it's going to go through three different ways that you can transform anxiety today. One way is movement. Um, with it, where anxiety is concerned, we need to be moving our body. We need to give ourselves something to do. I go into this more in the, in the episode and, and into it more in the um, ebook about why movement is so important for those of us who are feeling anxious. If people say, you know, oh, just sit down and meditate. That's as, like, that's as helpful as telling you to go take a nap when you're feeling anxious. That's not helpful. So movement is the first one. Thought work and really paying attention to what's going on in your mind. Being aware of the thoughts that are going on. Being aware of the habits and patterns that you have in your thinking. That's a super important step. Our thoughts create all of our feelings. We're going to go way into this in episode number five. So stay tuned for that. But episode number five is going to really hone in on what I call thought work. So I just touch on it in the episode today, in episode number one, and I just touch on it in the ebook. Like I said, stay tuned for episode five where we're going to go really into thought work. But thought work and how you're thinking is something you really have to pay attention to. And then the third way is breath. We can literally change our blood chemistry when we're paying attention to our breath. And that is important because when we're anxious, our blood chemistry changes with all of those stress hormones, the adrenaline, the cortisol, that fight or flight stress response. So by changing and taking control of your breath, you can literally change your physiological body and help yourself calm down. So that's what the ebook goes through. That's what the episode goes through. Um, well, that's kind of the second half of the episode. The first half of the episode, we really talk about what is anxiety. Um, we, we have to get clear on a few different ways to think about and talk about anxiety. So I start there, and then we go into the three ways to transform anxiety today. Now, episode number one was released today. Um, they are going to be released every Wednesday morning. So every Wednesday, hopefully, whether you're, whether you're commuting, when you're getting ready for your day, if you're going for a walk, um, maybe while you're making dinner, um, hopefully I can be with you every Wednesday and we can talk, you know, have this ongoing conversation about ultimately how to transform anxiety. So the first four episodes are all going to be in a, in a series. It's a four-part series under the theme of what is anxiety. We have to get clear on what we're dealing with before we can even begin to transform it. So um, we start with three different ways to think about, talk about, define anxiety. And then from there, we go into the three ways that you can begin to transform anxiety today. So like I said, I'll be doing these live at 11 a.m. Central Time every Wednesday. New episodes of the podcast are going to come out every Wednesday morning. There will be show notes on the website. You can always go to www.kellyhanlin, H-A-N-L-I-N, mccormick.com slash podcast slash, and then the number of the episode. So like this week, it's slash podcast slash one. You can find all the show notes there. You can find the download there. Um, you can find if there's any other resources or tools or anybody else that I mention, I'll list all of that stuff in the show notes. So you'll be able to go there and find all of the goodies that go with the episode. It'll complement it really nicely. And like I said, make sure to get your hands on the ebook. You can download that. You can print it out. You can have it for you today. Um, this week's is just an ebook. So no work for you to do, nothing for you to write, but it's something that you can um, download and either read through on your computer or on your phone, or you can print it out and you can carry it with you. But it's the three different ways that you can transform anxiety today. So 
Guys, I hope you have a wonderful Wednesday and a great rest of the week. I am so looking forward to being with you every week, um, both through the podcast and here on Facebook Live. If you don't already, come on over to Instagram as well. Um, I'm going to be doing some Instagram TV and um, stuff over there, so that'll be fun. We can do polls and we can do some other conversations there. So I am at K Hanlon McCormick on Instagram, and I would love to meet up with you there. So thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for being part of the community. I'm very much looking forward to continuing our relationship and just building this podcast, helping you, giving you, like I said, really actionable, practical, pragmatic tools and tips. So be sure to go over to the website, grab your ebook, and I will see you next Wednesday. Ooh, oh wait, one more thing, one more thing. There's a giveaway. Okay, so as we're starting the podcast, I'm also working on this bigger, much bigger online digital program for you. I can't believe I almost forgot about this. Um, So that will be coming out this spring. Now, I need your help. I need your help as I'm writing. I've, I've got a lot of ideas. I've been working around this stuff for years. I've been coaching for almost eight years now. So I've got a lot of ideas about what anxious people who are seeking coaching really want and need and um, what helps them. But I would love to hear from you. So I have created a quick survey. It's probably, it'll probably take you five to seven minutes or so. I've always, I've also linked to that um, here in the notes. And what I'm going to do when I come live next week on Facebook is a $50 Amazon gift card giveaway. So if you fill out the survey, your name is going to go into a drawing. I will do that drawing at this time next week. So you've got a full week to fill out that survey. But it would really, really help me just to you let me know, you know, what is on your mind? What do you struggle with when, um, where anxiety is concerned? What are you looking to learn? What have you tried before? What have you felt does or doesn't work? Um, how would you like to work on anxiety? So all those sorts of questions are are in the survey. Like I said, it's probably five to seven minutes. It won't take long, but it really, really helped me because then I can make sure that the course that I'm creating that's going to be coming out this spring is what you want and it's what you need and it's going to be super helpful. It's going to be so fun. Um, So yes, that was the last little tidbit. So you've got the ebook. Go to the website to grab the ebook. Uh, Kelly Hanlon McCormick slash podcast slash one. Um, the next link is for the survey. Check that out. And then I've also linked to the podcast, both the iTunes and the Stitcher version. And then hopefully at this time next week, I will have a Spotify link for you and an iHeartRadio. And then please comment below and let me know where else podcasts go. This is a whole brave new world. <laughs> so I need to know. Um, where do you listen to your podcast? Where, how would it be easiest for you to get the podcast? It'll always be on the website, but I want to make sure I'm on the platforms that you're using. So that's it for today. Thanks again so much, you guys. Ebook, survey, podcast. I will see you next Wednesday. Have an awesome, awesome day and an awesome week. Thanks, guys.